welcome to six little lambs. I can't see the camera. <laughs> it's become an occasional thing starting a bit of a video here, hasn't it? Yeah. We are heading out today. I am accompanied by Matthew woo, and Renee. Renee's just there doing cartwheels. Renee has just begged me to have a go in the Mingy Park. So Matthew's just in there with her making sure that everything's okay. She's just having one more go with the slides and then we're off. <laughs> What's that, the floss? It's flossing. Come on, men. Sanitize. Yeah. Head to the time. There we go. Oh, yeah, oh Matthew just got that all over me. Oh really? I'm sorry. So we are just heading out to get Joe some painkillers because he had some dental treatment done yesterday and he's in agony, real bad agony. He had root canal treatment. Yeah, he had some root canal treatment done and he's in worse pain than what he was in and his whole jaw is swollen and he's waiting for a clinical nurse to call him back but in the meantime he needs some stronger painkillers and some mouthwash and things like that. That's the only thing that's easing it. So that's where we're off to, to get some more. And I thought I'd get him another temporary filling kit but a different type of one for his other teeth to see if it's that that's causing the pain, maybe. I don't know. Nay is just having a go on the... What is this called? Gym equipment? It's, it is, it's gym equipment. It's a free park thing, I think. A campaign happened a while ago where they put gym equipment in all of the local parks to like make it more accessible for people to exercise so they don't have to pay gym fees. But I don't think a lot of people want to exercise in the park unless you're Renee. <laughs> yeah, I'm like Ebony and Zach and Matthew because you all love this park, don't yeah, you? I, know, I love that thing right there. But this is one of my, I don't sit down though. I stand up. Oh, I missed it. Just be careful, <laughs> don't want you to fall. And in stand up. It's like riding a bike. <laughs> You're going to be knackered. So yeah, we are just on route to get Dad some pain stuff and some light bulbs for the bathroom because if you've seen our last video, I got light bulbs for the bathroom and they were the wrong ones. So now Ooh. we've got to get some different ones and they're these weird fuse type ones which I've never seen before. So I'm hoping I can get them. Yeah, but to get them. Or I'll bathroom. have to go to a DIY store, yeah. probably. Uh, or maybe I don't call know. an electrician to tell you what bulb they are. No, Dad knows. Oh, really? Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. I'm going to put this away for now anyway and see what we can get while we're out. I don't want to I don't want to do another video of me gasping for breath while I'm walking. I'm going to show you when we're home what we're going to get. You're going to show when we're home? Okay. I'll um, try and see if I'm brave enough to record while record. I'm at the shops. I'm but I'm often not. Hi, this is Matthew here. There'll be a new um, shops around our area, so I'm going to show you one over there. We're getting one, one over there. That's Taco Bell. Taco Bell, and, and we're getting the KFCs, the white The KFCs ones. all the way down there. See, that it's right next to that um, yellow forklift thing, the white building. That's the KFC, McDonald's. That's what it's called. Yeah, and then there's got to be a gas station right there. And then just over there, the white building over there. Yeah, that's Morrison's, Morrison's and Home Bargains. Home and Bargains. Woo. It'll be much better once they've built it all because we don't have many shops around here, do we? No. We have like one frozen food store, yeah. so it'll be good. Through the dog aisle and the tool aisle right now, and um, we found what we need. The bulbs. How many will we need? I need two packets because I need three. Three. I'll get two for now actually because mm -hmm. then we can refund the other ones. <laughs> now we're uh, just gonna keep the other ones in the kitchen. Um, yeah. Warm white. Why? Break them from here. Look, phone cases. Favorite aisles. Eat aisles. Some more over here. And the girls keep going. 
but I'm a never need to I was able to get most of what I needed in the pawn shop, thankfully. We're almost done, we're just heading to go and get a taxi home. It's been really busy today, so there isn't much footage at all. And the bags are super heavy. So, super heavy. I guess I'll see you when we get home. I am home. God, my face is sweating off that mask. I have sanitized and everything. So, I'm going to do you a little mini haul. Some of these little egg cakes for Joe. I forgot what they're called. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you still know better. Mm. Pain still throb them. I've got him a fish cake as well to see if that if that's something he can eat because he hasn't had for two days. Uh, let's see what else we've got. Pasties, got you a chicken pasty as well in case that's something that you can eat. Oh. Bottle of coke. I've actually got two of them, which I know is important for this tooth pain, but I like coke too, so and they're cheaper than anywhere. So, got two bottles in home bargain. Got the kids a drink while we were out. Is that a knock? Yeah, it was a knock. I was dealing with that knock, so I'll carry on. Another pasty. And a sausage roll. And another sausage roll from Pan Bakery. I got some marshmallows for the kids to share out between them. Picked up a dental, temporary dental filling. Now, the other day when I did one of these vlogs, I showed a toothy peg, which I've been working fine, but this is the one like what the dentist uses. And they could only fix one tooth and he's actually got two broken. So we don't know if the pain's coming from the other tooth. So we thought we'd try this. And this was a father in home bargain. Mm -hmm. Cherry gasping in the background thought something had happened. He was going a father. Yeah, this was a father in home and bargain. For anybody who might need one but the toothy pegs are three pound ten in the chemist they are much more some stronger ibuprofen these are meant to be fast relief so once you do your next ones try these uh, half drank bottle of water some oral b strong teeth mouth wash mint with 24 hours protection because it's the only thing that is actually taking away his pain at the minute that it's in his mouth that's with mouthwash uh, halogen bulbs i don't know if matthew picked that footage up in the shop we actually found yeah, it yeah i did don't they weird bulbs for bathroom lights uh, them, yeah. Are they <laughs> very weird like isn't it to have them type of bulbs in a bathroom yeah, two packs I, of no, I got one because you said one of the bulbs are jammed in yeah, yeah. yeah. in by us by the way by the landlord or somebody who's lived here before us and i got this antibacterial mouthwash believe it or not this one was banned and it's like recommended by dentists and all that and this was two and i didn't know it was two pounds till i got to the till and last but not least uh breath spray because of course it saves you standing at the sink constantly spilling your mouth you could use this maybe for some relief i hmm, don't know so today's thing is all about your mouth uh, and that's all about the house ebony has here a packet of marshmallows from the other day yeah. and you shared them out with everybody yeah. very nicely didn't you there was five left was so five i got left. one wait yeah. no four yeah four there was four left yeah so we got another packet of so take three for now, because that's all you need for now. I took four. Okay, take four. Have you got the other one? Four. Yeah, four. Four. Okay. I took out. You got four, yeah? One, two, three, four. Yeah. Ooh. How many? Four. Two. And then you can have the others a little later on or tomorrow or something. Mm -hmm. I am going to fill my face with some water and a sausage roll. So now we are going to do little Miss Ebony's hair because she wants to play out. Yeah. And she, you can do your own hair, can't you? But yeah. when you put it in a pony, it gets a little bit tattered, doesn't it, yeah. at the back. So you're going to do it. What way do you want it? Uh, a plait. You want a plait? Yeah. Right down your head, two plaits, in a pony um, with a plait, or? Two. You want two plaits, so you want braids? Yep. Yeah? I got another bubble. Okay, are they matching? 
No. Look, oh, look at this cool bobble. Ebony got the other day a little kit. Yeah. So did Renee. And I you made get to colour your own bobbles. And this is the right side. This is <laughs> the side I didn't call the dark blue, as you can see here. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, and you got to make her headbands as well, didn't you? Yep. It's actually a pretty cool headband, and then the bow fell off. Oh, yeah, because the glue weren't really great in that set, was it? No. A little LOL, make your own hair yeah. type set or something like that. And it was all, it had clips in it as well, didn't it? Yeah. yeah. Time for my most favourite job in the whole entire world. Get a dog, they say. Do not get a dog if you don't like picking up poop. It's not nice. That is all the dog mess picked up. Hands are scrubbed. And we have some good news about... Well, maybe good news about the tooth pain yeah oh, the yeah. clinical nurse has just rang back and joe's just explained everything about the dentist which i haven't yet done he had some dental work done yesterday they said he didn't have an abscess but if he got any swelling he might have an abscess that hasn't come out yet so to call back to get some painkillers he had two holes in the same place but they could only fix one because it was an emergency appointment and they weren't sure where the pain was coming from so he doesn't even know if he's at work done on the wrong tooth which is why i bought the filling kit oh it's just a bit chaotic um anyway tried to get an appointment this morning and they said that they couldn't fit him in anywhere and this was after they waste on the phone for three hours to get another appointment and it was literally just for antibiotics so we phoned is it 111 the nhs direct we phoned them they very kindly put us through to a clinical nurse because of the amount of swelling that he's got like all on one side of his face and she's just called back and just said they don't usually deal with dental problems but she can hear in his voice the amount of pain that he's in and she doesn't want him to have to go to a and e unnecessarily so she's going to put us through on a category two triage for a doctor to perhaps give him some antibiotics because we know the antibiotics that he needs because the dentist mentioned them yesterday thankfully so hopefully there will be an end to this pain soon and hopefully he won't end up in A&E. He's been advised if his tongue swells anymore or his face swells anymore or he can't drink or it affects his breathing. He's got to go to A&E because it could be going down into the soft tissue bone, something like that. So, fingers crossed. We'll have to eat teeth, guys, because during this pandemic, there's just, there's just not a lot of help out there at all, which is understandable, obviously, because I wouldn't want to be in this position of having to look in someone's mouth who hasn't been tested for COVID or, or whatever. But to leave you like this is, is terrible. He's got some time off work now to hopefully get it better. But it's horrible seeing him in this pain and no sleep. And he hasn't really sat down either because he's having to be at the sink permanently, which isn't nice. Bad news. The dentist doctor person just phoned back. And there's nothing that they can do. They've said that, hang on one minute. I was just carrying the clean washing basket up the stairs and I couldn't walk, talk and carry that <laughs> at the same time. Yeah, uh, basically there's nothing that they can do for him. Um, he's got to ring back at eight o'clock tomorrow morning and hopefully get some help then. But for now, he's got to stay in pain or go to A&E, which he doesn't want to do. Thought I'd chew the lights. <laughs> so there's just them two because this one has been wedged in or something joe said it doesn't like twist out like normal or clip out or like the others anyway um It is much later on in the evening now, so it is. What time Bed is it? Time. Bedtime. 
these little ladies and boys are going to get settled down for the evening, watch some telly and then go to sleep. And I am going to enjoy the evening watching the last season of Keeping Up With The Kardashians. Who else watches those? Comment down below. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video today. If you did, please give us a huge you thumbs, thumbs up. up. Subscribe and click the notification bell so you never miss none of our videos. We upload... New videos. Every... Thursday <laughs> with bonus uploads during the week. See you, See you again, again soon. soon. Bye. Bye.